Welcome into 2021 Albany Dutchman Player Introductions. I'm Joey Palatsky, voice of the Albany Dutchman, and today I'm joined by three players coming from New York colleges. Tom Kretzler is a grad student at SUNY Brockport, where he pitches and plays outfield. He's from Albany, New York, and played high school locally at Colony Central High School. Tom hit eight home runs at Brockport this year, which led the SUNYAC. Anthony Amoroso is a senior pitcher at SUNY New Paltz. He's from Monroe, New York, and attended high school at Monroe Woodbury High School. Anthony struck out 53 batters this year, which also led the SUNYAC. Tristan Nemjo is a freshman pitcher at Hofstra University. He's from Troy, New York, and played high school locally at Tamarack High School. Tristan set a school record with 11 home runs in his junior year at Tamarack. Guys, thanks for joining me today. Thanks for having me. Thank appreciate it. All right, so first question here, Tommy. You're a grad student at Brockport. Um, what's your grad degree in, and what do you plan on doing with it after this year? Um, so I'm actually um, still in an undergrad, so I'm in my second major. I started off in business, uh, I finished that, and now I'm finishing my degree in kinesiology. Okay, now, a Anthony, you were a fifth year, you're, you did your fifth year at New Paltz this year. Uh, you're also captain of the baseball team. Just talk about how special it was getting the C and um, being named captain of that Hawks team this year. Uh, yeah, so I've been there for five years, and, um, you know, it, it was just it's just an honor that the teammates and my guys like trust me to give me that role. So that was really humbling. And I appreciated that a lot. Yeah. Now, Tristan, I want to get into you here. You're a freshman at Hofstra this year. So a little on the younger side, these guys are a little older here, but um, you were a standout in both football and baseball at Tamarack. I saw um, one of the top players at quarterback and punter. And then I think it said you led New York state with 11 home runs. So how did you end up deciding on baseball? Well, I actually only played football my senior year. I'd never played football before, but knew there was an opening at quarterback, so I decided to play. knew I had a good arm and a good leg, so gave it a try, and I did pretty well, I think. Um, so, I mean, it was a pretty easy choice for me. I'd always been a baseball player. I'd always loved baseball, so I knew that was what I was going to do. So you just ended up being, like, one of the best players around, just stepping into quarterback. That was your first time doing it? I mean, I do come from a really small school, so there wasn't the most talent, I'd say, at my school. So, you know, like I said, I had a good arm, had a good leg, so I gave it a shot and ended up working out pretty well. All right. Yeah, now I want to get back to Tom here. Um, so what went into your decision to join the, the 2021 Dutchman this season? Um, you know, I'm just lucky to be able to play another year, and uh, I figured if they're going to let me play, I might as well do it, so... Yeah, no, Anthony, same question for you. It's going to be your third summer in Albany playing for the Dutchman. So what went into your decision to come back? Um, well, when I found out that we got our year of eligibility back after this year, um, I decided that next year I'm going to go for another master's degree. And like, like Tom said, you know, if they're going to let me play, I might as well. I have my whole life to work. So I'm going to play as long as I can. Yeah, definitely. Now, Tristan, same thing for you. What, what went into your decision? It's going to be your first summer with the Dutchman. What went into your decision to come, to come up to Albany this year? Yeah, so uh, my dad's actually been in contact with Coach Davey for a few years now, I think. We actually hosted a kid a couple years ago. So, you know, now that I'm playing college baseball, it just worked out for me to be able to play for the Dutchman this summer. Yeah, now, Tom, Tommy, I want to get back to you here. So you led the SUNYAC this year with eight home runs. Just talk about, um, you know, your, your, your ability to hit the long ball at the plate and just how, how amazing of a feeling it is when you get a hold of one. Yeah, um, it's definitely the most fun part of baseball, for sure. Um, you know, for me, I, I guess it's all mental. Um, you know, just if I can be able to put myself in good counts, then I think that's um, that's kind of the big factor uh, for me when I'm hitting more home runs. So, yeah. Now, opposite side of that count, but same same conference here. So, Anthony, you also led the Suniak in a stat this year with 53 strikeouts. So, just talk about going out there on the mound and dominating. How feel how good it feels again, just sitting sitting guys down. Yeah, I mean, it definitely helps that I didn't face guys like Tommy this year because we didn't play Brockport. But, um, yeah, no, it's a good feeling. Um, I had some pretty good stuff and some good days where I felt good. And, you know, just to be better than the guy that's 60 feet away from me, for me, that's the best part of the game. Yeah, now, Tristan, you've made nine appearances out of the bullpen at Hofstra as a freshman this year. So just talk about um, making the immediate impact as a freshman, walking right in there and seeing some good game action and making a, making a difference on the mound. Yeah, no, I mean, it was tough at first because of all the guys we had this year because of COVID, like the fifth years and the six years. But I think I was able to prove to the coaches that I deserve a spot in the bullpen. And I've been pitching pretty much every weekend, and I'm super satisfied with what I've done so far. Yeah, no, Tom, you were a, a two-way guy at Brockport this year. 
uh, hitting third and pitching a lot of games. You don't see that too much at the college level. So just talk about which one do you like more between pitching and hitting and how do you balance it? I definitely like hitting more. Um, but as far as balancing it in, in practice, I do a lot more uh, pitching work. Um, just because you kind of got to keep on top of the arm care and stuff. But um, yeah, definitely got to hit a little less to balance both, but it's, it's not too hard. Yeah. Now, Tristan, I want to ask that same question to you as you, I saw you did both in high school. And like I said earlier, led New York state with 11 home runs junior year. So which, which of the two do you like and how do you balance it? Um, I'd say I'm still a hitter at heart. I still like hitting probably a little bit more than pitching, but this year I've definitely focused on pitching and, Grown to like it quite a bit. I like just being the have the competitiveness on the mound, being the one controlling the game. So, I mean, I'm actually not hitting this year at college, but hopefully that will come down the road. Yeah. Now, Anthony, next question I have for you here. In in all of the research I've done for these player interviews so far, one of the more interesting things I found is on your new Pulse bio. It said one of your hobbies is getting tattoos. You have a favorite one you have so far? Um. Yeah, I have a bunch. I have um. I have some on my legs. Uh, I have half of my left arm, my whole chest, and my ribs done. Um, I would say my whole entire like chest from across is probably my favorite. It's a, a painting that I have in my house um, that I got on me. So that one means a lot to me. It's from my mom. And, um, yeah, I mean, I'm still going to get more. I'll probably end up getting more this summer. But, yeah, it's definitely a hobby of mine. Yeah, that's great. So final question here for all three of you guys. So Anthony's played three summers in, the, in, in Albany, Tristan from Tamarack. And then Tommy from Colony. So you guys are all familiar with the Albany area. What's some of your favorite things to do on the on the off days over the summer? Um, I like to golf. I'm not good at it, but <laughs> I like to do it sometimes. Yeah, I agree. I play a little golf. I'm also not too good at it. Um, I'll go fishing. You know, there's SPAC and the track up in Saratoga. That's always fun. That'll be open this year. So lots of stuff to do. Um, my host family this year and last year was in Chatham, so it was a small town. So I, uh, I would go fishing a lot in the nearby pond and then um, go up to Lake George with some of the guys and even, uh, you know, go up to the track races and stuff. That was a good time when we went two years ago with all the guys. So definitely Saratoga was a good time. Yeah, I think that's a lot of great recommendations there. That's going to wrap it up for today's Albany Dutchman player introductions. Anthony Amoroso, Tommy Kretzler, and Tristan Nemjo joining the 2021 Dutchman. Guys, thanks for joining me. Oh, thank you. Thanks for having us.